Within TD Snap, there is a really great feature that you should um, use or show the family you're working with to use, and that is the um, search button. It's on the top left-hand um, corner. It's like a little magnifying glass or the typical search button feature. Um, it's, it's pretty easy to find right above the little speak window. Um, what I would do is when you're unsure of where a word is or when you're still learning the system, before you program a new word as well, just to make sure that you're not programming a word twice, I would click on that top little search button and you can really search any button. So for example, maybe I wanna find dog. It'll search for all the different types of, of words that have um, dog in it, but I want the animal dog. And so I'll actually gray out the screen somewhat and highlight the little word by kind of that little line surrounding it. You wanna click and follow that dog and it will lead you to the word um, the one main thing that I do want to mention is that if you are on vocabulary filter which is this little filter on the top if you turn it on you'll see that some of my stuff is hidden if you search a word that happens to be hidden it will um, show as so for example I'm trying to think which one I had um, hidden so like for example if I were to search think so think is one of my hidden words. So if I were to search think, you'll see that it's gonna show you where it is as if you had nothing hidden. So when think. you press it, it'll show think, but then it will disappear and you'll, and you'll say, hey, I did want that visible. So to um, make sure that it is visible in your next use, you wanna go back to the filter and you wanna press on it so it's not grayed out anymore and then click done and then now it is um, visible to the user. Um, but this is how you search within TD Snap Motor Plan.